Boys, a little motivational quote for the day. A person can change the direction of their future by merely changing their attitude. Now look, I just wanted to make a quick video explaining how I edit my YouTube videos and just the basics to it. And I use a software called HitFilm Express and I've seen lots of YouTube videos on the software DaVinci, DaVinci Resolve, and that is the original one that I had. I, I've done a lot of videos on DaVinci Resolve, and it's good, it's nice, I honestly really like it, but for some reason, when I just when I downloaded HitFilm Express and when I started using this, the only thing I wish they could change about it, or I wish I could change, which because it could be an option, I just don't know, I wish you could make it dark mode, so that way all this isn't white, because sometimes when, when, when you're editing and just just focus it's just like sometimes like dries your eyes out but anyway i just really liked the simplicity of this and yeah i really liked it but it it also is quite restricting to to doing more advanced edits but this is going to be kind of like a beginner beginner guide on how to edit videos i'm just going to use the video that i just uploaded the last video that i just uploaded for an example you grab this thing right here at the top, which is showing where you are, and you go right where you're about to play, and then you right click with your mouse, you slice it, slice it in half like I've done, and then make sure, make sure that you're clicking this, make sure this is highlighted, remove, and then move this to the beginning, and boom. Now, as soon as we press play. Alright, boys, today, me the and intro. homie. The intro. And then, all the other stuff, like... Other stuff in terms of in terms of clipping time is like you can you use this bar down here to zoom out and zoom in and you can zoom in real close and then you can see like gaps in between where I stop talking and where I'm processing my thoughts. So then I'll just edit those out if they're too big again. But I don't like I don't like editing a lot of gaps because then it's just like sounds choppy and weird. But like it just sounds weird. But if <clears throat> like for example when i just thought about my thought right there i'll probably cut that out i don't know but even if i don't it's just like you don't all you don't always just want to see someone thinking about what the fuck they're gonna say so people will cut that out and you can do that and also next up is i another thing that really helps me is import to you go to import and then get your video but what really helps me is I have a folder editing tools and I only have a couple, I only have a couple so far and I just keep adding to them, adding to them. You guys have probably seen this many, many times, but this is like my favorite one is to just play this and you can even, you can even like boom, take this and then I'll, I'll slice this and I'll remove the bigger part and then I'll just use like a small part of it. So it's just a quick little burp and then we're just on to whatever's next. But in order, in order to get clips like that, because people might also be curious about that, in order to get clips like that, I just go on my Streamlabs, here we are, hi, and I just record, and if I'm going to record a clip like that, I'll remove, I'll remove my webcam, I'll remove my webcam, and I'll remove the stuff at the bottom, and then boom, record like this, and you just look up, you look up on YouTube, like, what you're trying to look for, like, for this, I just looked for, like, I don't even remember what I looked up, but just look up like commercial, commercial beep or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> just I like whatever you're thinking of and whatever you want for the, the Kawhi, for the Kawhi laugh. All I typed in was the Kawhi laugh. And then for the, this one's a gotcha bitch. And I've only used it once, but all I typed in, gotcha bitch. And then the rock meme, I just typed in the rock meme. Like you don't have to be super s specific and you don't have to know exactly what you're thinking of. You just got to know like a couple general things and the internet's ridiculously powerful they can find literally anything you're thinking of and they probably already know what you're thinking of but with that being said another i don't know this doesn't really necessarily have to do with editing videos but it just it it, it has to do with like processing your videos and making sure that it's in good format you want to make sure that your videos down here 1920 times 1080 you want to make sure that you're importing 10 1080p 60 fps clips and you want to make sure your project settings is the template there's a whole bunch of templates but you want to be using 
1080p HD at 60 FPS. And for I'm gonna make another video. I'm gonna make another video how to do TikTok shorts and stuff like that. But you want to be 1080p 60 FPS, and the rest don't matter. Just 1080 60 FPS. Press OK, and that's after you press File New. That's after you make the project, and then you import. But to 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 make sure if you're using Streamlabs OBS to make sure that your uh resolution is 1080p, you gotta go. You gotta go to your settings in the bottom left of your Streamlabs OBS and then come down to video and make sure that your resolution is 1080p. Make sure, make sure. And when we go to this screen, this this stuff down here, like this whole screen was actually in 1080p or 720p. So when I when I stretched it to 1080p, it made everything smaller, but all you gotta do is just like boom. Yeah, I'm gone, but you just gotta you just gotta make it fit to the 1080 and then it'll record good. With all that being said, I'm trying to think of what else, what other tips I could give. Mm, that's all you really need, to be honest. This is just a quick little video. I don't want to drag it on too long because I remember when I was younger, I, I really was inspired to make YouTube videos, edit them, make them look cool. But I was just, it all seemed so complicated to me. And I'm gonna let you know right now, it's really not. All you gotta do, you just gotta, you gotta dip your toes in the water to, to, to truly be able to understand anything. Think about everything you've done in your life. Before you did it, you were like, I don't know if I'll be able to do that. And once you get the hang of it, just like, yeah, I can do that, I can do that. And that's that's just the mindset you gotta have. No matter what you do in life, you can, you can do it. You just gotta experience it to know whether you actually enjoy it or not. And for YouTube videos and making YouTube videos, you don't want to you don't want to make them in in the in the form of just getting rich quick, get blowing up quick, doing everything to blow up. You just want to do it for your enjoyment. And that's what I've fallen in love with recently is just realizing that it's like you can't at the end of the day, you can only you can only control so much in life. You change the changeable, accept the unchangeable and remove yourself from the unacceptable and think about that that's life and just don't ever forget that and don't ever don't ever let things in life bring you down because at the end of the day we're all we're all here for a short amount of time no matter no matter how long you think it is and you want to enjoy every single moment so the main reason i love youtube also is just eventually being able to create so many memories and being able to look back on these memories and watch videos on them rather than just think about them in our mind in our mind that's what i just i can't wait to be able to show even though like some crazy stuff might be said in the future like not like not like bad stuff but just like even though some things we probably wouldn't want the the next generation seeing it's just like it's, that's the beauty of life and evolution and this is going on a rant and nobody's probably fucking listening but if you did listen i really appreciate you drop a like and subscribe to the youtube algorithm i really appreciate you guys and i hope you guys i hope this video was helpful in some way and i hope you guys enjoyed appreciate you guys peace out